Hey guys, take a moment to watch the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to fix your iPhone screen that is glitching or it's a glitch screen on your iPhone. You're going to follow these steps to hopefully fix your iPhone screen. So let's get started. So the first thing is if your iPhone screen is glitching out of nowhere, let's say you didn't drop it or it didn't get damaged anyways. Uh, one thing you want to check out is the temperature of the phone, especially if you're in extreme heat or extreme uh, cold weather, sometimes the screen can actually finick and glitch so you want to try to be in a normal temperature which again sounds crazy but that's kind of the way these screens sometimes work with the OLED technology here so try to make sure your phone is at normal temperature now the next thing you want to do in your setting of your iPhone to try to solve this problem is turning off by going into your settings here and then you want to go to in your accessibility option you want to go here over to display and text size and go down here where you have auto brightness now auto brightness is great but sometimes it can also make your iPhone screen glitch you want to go ahead and turn that off and see if that makes a difference with the glitching on the screen here now after you have done that let's say that didn't make any difference uh, you want to move on to the next thing which is checking if your iPhone has enough storage available when the iPhone is maxed out sometimes apps and certain things it starts glitching so you want to go into your setting of your iPhone and then go to general and this time around we're going to look at iPhone storage now you want to ensure that you have at least maybe a couple gigs available as you can see here I'm using in uh, 29 gig just a little over 29 over 128 gig I have 98 gig free let's say you're using up all of it and you have almost close to zero gig free which will show right here you'll need to go ahead and delete some apps usually long format videos some stuff Apple will show up here just delete them and free up some space and that should help you as well with the screen glitching the next thing you want to do if you're still having the issue is go into again main settings here we're going to go back to accessibility here and under accessibility we're going to go to uh, display and uh, text size again and we're going to turn on enable reduce transparency now when this is turned on right it's going to reduce the transparency in order to counter any glitching so go ahead and turn that on and see if that makes a difference along with that we're going to go ahead and turn off uh, auto brightness so with these two combinations see if that makes a difference for you now let's say you did all that and still having issues the next thing you want to do is do a force restart on your iPhone now in order to do a force restart you're going to press and release the volume up press and release the volume down one after another quickly and then hold this side button until the screen goes black and once you see the Apple logo you let go of that side button so we're going to do volume up volume down quickly and then hold that side button again make sure you press volume up and down quick enough and then hold that side button just like I am and you do not need to slide to power off just wait till the screen goes black and we're gonna wait for the Apple logo to appear before we let go of that side button and if it didn't work the first time try a few times for it to do it so you want to keep on doing volume up volume down quickly and then hold that side button until the screen goes black and the Apple logo appear and that's basically shutting down the phone software and reloading the code so if it's a software related bug or glitch impacting the phone having that screen glitch it will fix it for you now another thing you also want to ensure that your battery power at least 20 percent or more when you have lower percentage of battery the phone trying to use up the power can also mess with the OLED uh, display here which requires certain level of battery power so you may notice slowness or glitchy screen so make sure your phone is charged up as well now another thing to consider is if you recently downloaded any apps or if it's a specific app when you go in your iPhone screen glitches you need to go ahead and delete or remove the app in order to delete any app on your iPhone simply find the app you want to delete press and hold until you get this menu pop up and click on remove and then delete app and it will delete it now if you want to go ahead and you can try to reinstall it again go back to of course app store and then search up your app and try to reinstall it again and it could fix it for you now that's if it's an app a new app that you downloaded and you notice the iPhone screen glitching on you now after you have done that the next thing you want to do is go into your setting of your iPhone go to general software update it's important to always update your phone when it comes to any issues that you're experiencing doesn't hurt to update your phone so go ahead and update it give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes whenever you're doing any software update and make sure your phone is at least 50 percent or more charge or connected to power or charging whenever you're doing this update as well now after you have done the update and it's still not working the final and the last thing you can do is backing up your phone and then doing a factory reset 
and then restoring again. That process takes a little bit of time, which we explain in another video. We'll leave the link for that video so you can do that. Now, even if after you did all of these troubleshooting steps and the screen is glitchy, most likely the screen is defective. It needs to be replaced. Uh, you can go take it to the Apple Store or authorized Apple Retail uh, repair shop where they can take a look at it and give you an idea if it really needs to be replaced in certain cases. If it gets dropped at a certain angle, there's really not much you can do, especially if it cracked or something like that. It's going to be have to be replaced. So I hope this video will help you guys fix your glitched iPhone screen. If so, please consider hitting that like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.